Hello friends, welcome multitudes and today we will learn how to create the water droplets that is uh, on a screen of something glass or uh, window layer and uh, we have uh, used this water uh, droplet using the after effect presets uh, after effect uh, presets that's called uh, CC Mr. Mercury and uh, the wallpaper that we have used in this scene as you can see it's a vintage wallpaper we have downloaded from uh, the site uh, wallpaperswhite.com and it's a great site uh, for uh, wallpapers and you can download uh, in uh, many uh, sizes wallpaper from here so uh, in the water droplets we just uh, use uh, two of uh, wallpaper and make that duplicate so let's uh, create a new uh, scene of water droplet let's uh, go with a new composition and uh, just make the 15 second duration what your name you can write it here water okay so for this scene we just uh, have a new wallpaper like uh, this one will be okay yep and uh, add to the after effect project area and now it's uh, wallpaper i have uh, downloaded in uh, size of 1920 into 1080 format so just drag and drop into the scene and uh, for uh, droplet uh, you need to uh, duplicate this like uh, one will be your scene and one will be merged with the droplets and uh, for that just type merc you can see mercury and drop that on first layer and right now you can see it's uh, clear not uh, showing anything when you just drag the uh, frame up to forward to see some water type of shapes are uh, uh, popping up from center so making that in a water droplet shape just uh, may, we need to increase the radius so that our uh, droplets will merge the screen I just make it a hundred and again same thing uh, increase the y direction to cover up all the y direction layer and then the direct uh, velocity like uh, you can see it uh, going downward very fast so we need to decrease the velocity up to around I think right now zero and uh, it's growing down so gravity must also be decreases I just make it 0.2 so it will go down in a very smooth and uh, slow way just like water and uh, longevity, uh, long longevity is we should also decrease as it uh, will decrease the size of your uh, droplets and birth rate you can see that uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, droplets are uh, on to the screen so you can decrease the birth rate i just make it 0.5 around and uh, next is uh, animation uh, you may choose uh, wherever you want your direction like i uh, just choose the direction and uh, you can choose the direction or it will go from top to bottom and uh, next is you can choose the resistance also it will uh, like it's uh, uh, glasses uh, uh, glasses surface when you choose the resistance heavy then the droplets will pop a little heavy uh, now we just make the resistance zero next is the uh, influence map you can choose the in and out the constant blobs like when you choose the constant blobs uh, it's 
shows a constant block from top to bottom and uh, part size you just increase the part size and decrease the birth test size like it will then something along yeah. fill on uh, drop on the screen and then uh, move it further and then hide and this is how you can uh, use this and the next is the uh, light you can choose the light option further you can choose the uh, uh, another shadow type motion like uh, what type of uh, ambient you want so i just make it a hundred these are the settings and uh, next uh, there are some uh, another settings you can do whichever you want. Let's increase the diffuse to three. I think it's okay. And next, uh, you can see what droplets coming onto the screen and going down. So next uh, is uh, like uh, what you are seeing. Um, behind the glass so we'll uh, make uh, behind the scene uh, another scene in a blur also so choose the fast blur and drop onto the second layer and increase the size you can see as the uh, scale is uh, exact to the comp size so when you choose the blurriness more so it's showing some transparency here so you can apply a solid background behind or just uh, scale it further this is how you can make the scene something droppy and uh, um, some water droplets onto that in our project we have uh, also add uh, some rain here and uh, apply a motion uh, keyframe motion onto this uh, second layer so that you can see that the scale is up and then down to the composition size and it's also the blurriness uh, change from some 50 to 0 so that uh, showing some camera movement uh, like uh, uh, camera adjustment is showing the glass to outer area so that it's showing some blurriness to clear clear views uh, you can uh, choose this uh, adjustment to your scene also and uh, right now we'll uh, just uh, close this session and uh, this was for water droplets so although you can download this project file from the uh, link available in the description so that you can find more thing uh, uh, that we have done into this scene and uh, hope you've done well and uh, don't forget to download the project and it will be great to have uh, learn more things and thanks for watching hello viewers thanks for watching the tutorial check out our other playlist and videos to multiply your knowledge meanwhile you can also download the project file from the link available in the description and please don't forget to subscribe the channel for next release. Until then, thank you very much. See you. Goodbye. Sayonara. Alvida.